Well, really, Kayla Spangler is just an inspiring young woman. She was diagnosed with terminal cancer, and now in what may be her last few weeks, her family and the community are just rallying behind her, ensuring that she lives every day to the fullest. A loving, caring, and bubbly personality, Kayla Spangler is the oldest of three siblings, all still mourning the sudden loss of their father, and now faced with yet another battle. I had saved for brain cancer. Diagnosed with glioblastoma in the fall of 2020 following an ATV accident, scans showing multiple brain tumors. It just, it kind of blindsided us. You know, it's, it's something that no parent ever, you know, thinks that's gonna happen to their children and, and then it does. And she's been through it all. Brain surgery, countless chemo and radiation treatments. They were able to remove like 98% of the tumor um, but it's such a monster cancer. Um, it's fast growing. So uh, they initially gave her six to 12 months and um, she surpassed that. Next month will be two years. Now bedridden, the tumors continue to grow. Doctors giving her just weeks to live. I just stay positive because that's all you gotta do is stay positive. The family now trying to make the most out of a difficult situation. I've always taught my kids, you know, you always live for today, never live for tomorrow. You know, and I think it's a good motto to live by because we're not promised tomorrow. We're not guaranteed that. And only God knows when we're going to be called home. The community rallying behind her. Kayla crowned homecoming queen at Franklin County High School. The community, the support, everybody around here has just been truly amazing. And so tomorrow, the family will celebrate a milestone as Kayla graduates high school. Now, she'll receive her diploma at the VFW in Brookville. The community is also coming together to give Kayla an early Christmas celebration. That's this Saturday. I'm Yana Massey, WLWT News.